Hello and welcome to round 6 of the RPM Clio Cup here at the Red Bull Ring. Thanks for joining us, qualifying will begin in a moment.
but in the high tech it's way slower than if you do it manual. Yeah, that as well. Oh, here it's also way slower. But it, it does work. But All clear. Push now. All right, Marty. We've got 14 minutes to set a lap. Let's get some heat into these brakes. Your tires are cold. Watch out. Can't hear you, Jim. Yeah, it's alright, no worries. Oh, cold tires. Well, that's a line. Fucking <laughs> hell. We're seeing lots of right rear locking. Leader's just done a 55.3. The guy behind has just done a 55.6. B4. You're locking your right rear. The leader has just done a 55.0. Bloody hell. Sector 2 is two tenths off the pace. He's in the 54s. P4, that was a 55.8. You're two tenths off the pace in Sector 1. You're locking your right rear. Okay, Marty. Five minutes of fuel remaining. Five minutes. The leader's just done a 54.9. Back to back. We need to find a tent in sector two. Tire temperatures are good. Your brake temps are good. P3, that's your quickest lap. <laughs> Sector 1 is 0.3 off the pace. <laughs> You've used half your fuel. Ten minutes remaining, ten minutes. <laughs> You're locking your right rear. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
There's traffic behind. Keep your wits about you. Your brakes are cold. We need to get some heat into them. Cold tires all round. The guy behind has just done a 55.6. Estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. P5. Two tenths off the pace in sector one. Just done a fifty five point seven. Car right. Still there. Right side's clear. Car right. Clear right. Your tire temps are looking good. We're seeing lots of right rear locking. You're a tenth off the pace in sector two. You've just done a 55.6. Sector three is 0.3 off the pace. Sector 1 is 0.4 off the pace. Your brake temperatures look good. You're locking your right rear. remaining. You're two tenths off the pace in sector two. P5. Sector three is 0.4 off the pace. The Looks like that was outside track limits. Sector one is 1.5 off the pace. Okay, Marty, we estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. Five minutes to go, five minutes left. The pit exit's clear. You've got cold tyres. We need to get some heat into them. Your brakes are cold. Be careful. The leader has just done a 54.9.
be a cut. Yeah, definitely cut. Well, that might be outside track limits. Or not. You're a tenth off in sector one. You're locking your right rear. There's a better line. I think turn one will give us a lot of truck warning today. Yeah, it's tricky. So, not counting in the safety car, the race should be around 44 laps. You're out of track limits there. And you'll need around one, between 105 and 180. Sector 1 is 0.3, off the pace. Last one, right? You're locking your right rear. That is, if it's dry, of course. Yeah. Well, we had rain in this cup. Well, the weather is set to random, so we can have rain. Well, no, but have we had is so far? Three. Off the face. Yeah, no. The tire temperatures no. look good. No, I think we... Did we have a moist track? One race? Two minutes to go. Two minutes. That uh, lap was at 56.0. Right. <laughs> Two minutes of fuel remaining. Sector 3 is... 0.5 yeah. off the pace. Suzuka, I thought, but maybe I'm just thinking of a different race with AMSU or. Yeah, could be as well. I'm not sure. Alright, come on. Very little fuel left. That lap was at 55.6. You're outside track limits there. Shit. That's Watch it. the track limits, please, Marty. Bollocks, where are we? This. everywhere. That's the end of the session, P5. Not as many cars on the grid today. Can we have a two or three minute pause between the quality and the, the race? Yes, please, yeah, I'd yeah, like that. For sure. Thanks. Nice lap, Ben. Let's uh, continue with 5 past... Uh, 35 past the hour. Thanks, Silas. I can lapse, everyone. Yeah. Yeah, everyone. Brilliant. Well done. Should be a close race. Yeah, very close in the top three. Mm. 
only 12 people. I think that's the least of our, all our Clio uh, races. Yeah. It's because Wes is in chat today. <laughs> Twenty were registered, right? Or not right? Yeah, something like no, that. No, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah I think like a couple dropped out last minute. So yeah, eighteen or nineteen people. Strategy then, guys. People were asking what I was going to do. So pretty much the same as what I've done on all races. So full tank at the start. When you pit, make sure you've set up a front tyres only stop. That saves you time in the pits. And if you can do it under full course yellow, do it under full course yellow. It becomes a free stop. So under full course yellow, if you can pit under full course yellow, take as much fuel as possible and a set of front tyres. And then you're looking at uh, whatever fuel you need to get to the end of the race in your second stop. It very much depends on when that FCY comes out. Um, I, Roy says 44 laps, I've worked out as no more than 43, possibly 42, um, but you know, you each do what you want to do. You'll never get that seat of Mercedes giving your strats away all the time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you're in traffic, because it's going to be, a, they're always hard to overtake in these, if you're in traffic and you know you've got enough fuel to do a splash and dash and you might come out in a bit of space, um, then that's what did it for me last uh, last event. I was sort of seventh or eighth, came in for my splash as soon as I could, did seven or eight laps of clean traffic, whereas everybody else was, was in traffic competing and losing time. So, so yeah, that's the other tactic. Hmm... But, but definitely the front tyres, uh, as Tinez found out early on in the season, if uh, the tyres don't look that worn, but they cost you three to four seconds a lap, if not more, if you don't change them. Um, and tyre wear here, if you're pushing, is higher than some of the other tracks. So definitely take front tyres at least once. I wouldn't recommend it twice, but take it up, uh, once at least. I never took tyres in the, in the Clio before, so maybe I should today. Oh, well, you, you, yeah, won, well, you won it last week, didn't it? But I was ga I was gaining on you massively, so you could see that difference in the tyres. That was solely the tyres. Yeah. You know, it wasn't skill. We were similar pace, but with me having fresh tyres, your tyres are probably showing something like 70% wear, you know, only 30% yeah. gone, something like that. And yet yeah. you lose three or four seconds at least uh, with worn tyres. So it's a gamble. You could stay out and you could save yourself. But if you're, if you're pitting under full course yellow, hey, it becomes essentially free. Um, so, um, as I say... Uh, definitely take tyres if you can do it under full course yellow. If not, then it's the gamble as to whether losing more time in the pits taking tyres is worth it or not. Hey, then, Chris. Um, one thing to mention is pit entry. If you know you're going in the pits, don't be on the left side of a car. And try and peel <laughs> yeah. through them. Right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, don't yeah. want to do that. And if you if you are, if you and Mike, because most of you are, <coughs> don't do what I did and not turn out that you're going in the pit, because you do end up taking that corner before the pit a little bit slower, otherwise you risk overrunning the corner. So a little notice to the guy behind means he's not going to tap you by mistake whereas you try and get into the pit and he's not used to your 10k slower speed limit. Everyone ready to go? Yeah. Yes, yes. Yep. Yes, mate, I'm good, thanks. I'm still on the toilet. No joking. P5, yeah, stream deck's working. Minutes. Um, ooh, cloudy. Heavy cloud. What will that bring in the second slot? What's rain, please? Sunshine. Well, I think we might have rain tonight. Oh. Hope so. Yeah, it would be nice for a change. No, no rain. How many weather slots do we have? Two. Two. Oh. Okay, so it changes mid race. Yeah. Uh, that's, well, that's a little about. bit random, but. Yeah, there's a bit of a margin of, uh, I think, two minutes either way or something like that. It usually tends to transfer into the second slot as well, so. Good luck, everybody. Don't forget, yeah. front tyres only. Can figure up in that pit strategy. It's the way to go. Good luck. Have fun. Good luck. Good luck. Uh, take the first corner like you're trying to stay within the lines. And alive. 
Yeah. Good luck, have fun. Yeah, good luck. 40 minutes. Okay, Marty. Stay calm. Focus. Green, green, green. Uh, on your right. Shit. Hold your line. Somebody is still that? standing on the He's still there. start. Yeah, that's me. So watch out. Uh, yeah, still with there. Elevation. Be right. Right side. Lost a few positions there. there. Fuck. Hold your line. I'm still on the outside. Fuck. He's still there. He's still there. Still there. Managed to get it going. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Clear right. Did you have the same issue last week, Wes? Or was that someone else? Same issue. Left side. Still there. Hold your line. He's still there. He's still there. On your right. Right side's clear. B6. A lot of trust there. Side by side behind. We've seen lots of right rear locking. And the Dutchman would say, half for the dumber. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> Sixth place. Okay, Marty, the next car is daily. Your lap time was 55.3. Left side. Still there. Still there, clear left. We're seeing lots of right rear locking. Sorry for the rub, Super Valka. That's okay. Too much of that entry curve, I'm getting a bit too sideways, I think. Shit. That lap time was 56.9. Nice move, Floss. Thank you.
Sorry, new fastest lap for Tora, 55.3. The guy behind has just done a car right. Still there. Clear right. Well done, Marty. Great move. We'll keep it up. You're locking your right rear. front has just done a 55.5. Don't be pressured. Keep your exit speeds up. P5. You've just done a 56.3. Turning in too late. Okay, Marty, you've got 10 minutes of fuel remaining. You're locking your right rear. Fastest lap for Toran, 55.1. Sector 2 is two tenths off the pace. Lots of right rear locking. Right, Marty, you've got half your fuel left. Nice move. Thanks. You're locking your right rear. On your left. Still there. He's still there. Still there. Hold your line. Clear left. This is fucking great, mate. Keep it coming. P4. Your left front has a bit of wear. It does. Oh, 
wide, come on. You're locking your right rear. Let's go get Jim, come on. Quick shout out for Loz who's leading. Um, he had removed his content from his YouTube channel, but he's uh The lap time was at 55.7. It's back to uploading again. So he might upload a video of this race if he's not streaming. So go check his channel out. Quality driver. Link on uh, my channel, Loz Archer. Brian Hawkey, who's in P2, is currently leading the championship. I'm not sure where Lars is, he might be in second. That's five minutes of fuel left. Too slow through T1. You're locking your right rear. Okay, Marty, your lap times are pretty consistent. That lap time was 55.7. That was a weird line. You're locking your right rear. Jim's getting further ahead now. That's the new fastest lap for Toran, 55.1. Yeah, he's just done the quickest lap. Struggling to get away from Bubica. Slow that. minutes of fuel remaining. Always gains on me through that corner. We're seeing lots of right rear locking. P1 
four. All right, Marty, we're running on fumes, mate. Pit this lap, in this lap. Okay, pit stop requested. That lap was a 55.5. You're locking your right rear. Two litres left. Very little fuel left. In this lap, box this lap. Watch your speed. Fuck, that was close. I was so close to speeding in the pit. The leaders stay out. All done, go. The lead car's pitting. Pit exit's clear. Careful mate, your front brakes are cold. Turn around, it's now leading. <laughs> Air temps increasing, it's now 27 Celsius. I don't think we have rain today. No, no, no. Temperature is getting higher, so... Sun is coming out. Seventh position. The truck temperature is increasing. It's now 38 Celsius. Oh, he's done me. Car right. Right side's clear. That's the wrong fucking gear. Yeah, Hulk, it got the undercut on Lars. Hey Andy, how you doing mate? Have I undercut someone as well? Yeah, cheers mate. I think I was in fifth before my pit. Someone's probably taken all four tyres. Oh no, I was in fourth, wasn't I? There's Jim ahead of me. We're seeing lots of right rear locking. Just got out of track limits. Yeah, you haven't missed a lot, mate. I qualified like. D4. Okay, Marty, you're reeling. Turn around. In. The gap is 5.0 seconds. That was a uh, 55.5. Air and track temps are increasing. Air temperatures now 30. The track temperatures now 40 Celsius. Give me a fucking life story. Uh, qualified fifth, but I lost a couple of positions on lap one. And then we've done, I think, three overtakes so far. The gym's getting away. How you doing, Andy? Hope you're alright, mate. Your pedals all good now. Are they working well? You've got them tuned in. Shame you couldn't make the grid tonight. There's only 12 of us started today. 12 is not a bad grid size, but Clio Cup. Out of track limits there. It's quite low for Clio Cup. Track temperatures are increasing. Air temperature is now 32. The track temp is now 42 Celsius. Okay, Marty, don't let this guy distract you. So tank holds 44. 
I might need them. You're locking your right rear. I might need another 20 litres or so. There will be a safety car That's at some point. 20 minutes to go. How's my fuel? That's half distance. We estimate 15 minutes of fuel left. We think about 15 minutes of fuel remaining. 1.9 litres per lap. We'll need to add 14 litres to get to the end of the race. 1.9 litres a lap is totally wrong. We think you might have gone outside of track limits there. Oh, that's going to get in a bit. We're seeing lots of right rear locking. I thought I had T1 sorted out in practice, but clearly not. How's my fuel? Should be about 13 minutes of fuel remaining. 2.5 litres per lap. We think we'll need to add okay. 17 litres to get to the end. Oh, fuck. You're out of track limits there. What happened, Wes? Did you get disconnected? This gate can kiss my balls. The gap behind is now 0.9. You're outside yes, track limits there. <laughs> Went wide in the almost final corner You're and then three right bits. Shit. Oh, he's right on me now. Well, where's this gone? Not the line. It's like he used a bit of a slingshot to catch up there. B4. Jim's getting away. Safety car deployed. Can I fit my fuel in? Stay behind, turn around. Well, I can say that. Stay by the safety car. Hey, G Bear. <laughs> I Got might. 10 minutes of fuel remaining. I might be able to fit my fuel in. I've got room for... no, I don't... maybe... I'm pitting. Yeah, I'm gonna pit as well. Okay, pit stop requested. Pits are open. We expect to exit the pits in position 10, just ahead of P1. Pit crew is ready. It's followed me in. for the pit speed limit. I didn't put enough fuel, did I? I might be alright, it'll be alright. That was slow in though. Fuck. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I've got a full tank. Damn it. Curses, Boobica. Yeah, I was, I was dilly-dallying on the way in there. I thought that I hadn't queued up enough, but I had, and I was slowing down to check. It cost me time in the pit lane. Let's just try and save as much fuel as we can. The leader's pitting now. Safety car is out. Pits are now open. Okay, Marty, get ready. Race will resume at the end of this lap. Oh God, pit exit was closed apparently. Yeah, it's still the same for me. Let's hope it just doesn't pay attention. I didn't really go in the pits. 
it cleared the way for me before I exited the pits, so... 15 minutes left, that's 15 minutes. Did you get a warning, Jay? Where is he? I don't see... Where is Jay? Oh, he's in the fifth. No, he's right behind me. Oh, we got 20 you seconds each. Penalties, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's what I mean. We got 20 second penalty. Sorry, I was talking to the stream, not to here, but I'm just like, yeah, we got 20 second penalty each. It did not give a warning until after we exited oh, until the pit was exit was closed. Position. So that's a corker. After the first lap of safety car, after the first lap, um, crew chief yeah. then said, pit lane is now open, safety car is out. Yes, yeah, so it that's never what said we it was closed. Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah, but it said that it said the pit yeah. exit was closed, and it was because people were going past. And oh, so, yeah. but there was no indication. There was no indication in game that we had we couldn't leave the pits. What were you supposed to do then? Just sit and fucking wait. Well, I don't yeah, know if there's traffic, traffic lights at the end of the pits. Is there traffic lights at the end of the pits? Got caught napping a bit there. Whoa! Well, I fucking hell! Timed that right. Timed that well. Yeah, right. Nice launch, Bubica. <laughs> I was, I was fucking... All right. Yeah, I couldn't Whoa. overtake Steve because Sorry, I didn't know you yet. Clear right. Sorry, Dilly, didn't see that, mate. Sorry, man, I didn't understand. No problem. We just cut the track. I thought there was another lap of safety car to go. We're paying attention. Hopefully my fuel will make it. Left side. Clear left. Compromise me a bit. Shit. Yeah, um, safety cars, they are interesting, but... When it's when everyone knows there's going to be one, it does sort of force your strat a little bit. I know at NRT we've been running safety car on, for a good few weeks now, but we've never seen one. You're locking your right rear. Because no one's been crashing or DNFing. But yeah, the safety car in these races has been like been really good. a shame about their penalties, man. That's not fair. Oh shit. Can't be making mistakes when you got a loss in your mirror. Uh oh. Uh oh. Thank you, Bookman. Right side's clear. We're seeing lots of right me. rear locking. Looks like that was outside track limits. Track limits, watch those lines. I just painted myself a new track, I think. <laughs> I followed you, mate. Okay, Marty, stay close. We're trying right to make fun. a mistake. Ten 
minutes to go. That's 10 minutes left. Keep digging. This isn't over yet. We've seen some minor brake damage. Car left. Hold your line. Clear left. Gonna have to watch my stream back and find out if I did get any warning for that pit exit right closed. Side. Yeah, I'm making me nervous. Well. Still there. Oh, I'm sorry. Clear right. What was it? You're making me nervous. Ah, don't Just worry. Track I need to take a drive through anyway, so. You've got 10 minutes of fuel remaining. Your last lap time was at 56.1. Sector 2 is 0.5. Off the pace. Car right. Sorry, boobs. Clear right. <laughs> Car right. Ah, uh, that's cost me, that is. Still there. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Hold your line. Clear right. Bollocks. I should have taken a different line through T1 there. What happened to Carazada? Ah, wide. Yeah, I lost my motor. That's my final warning. Don't really want to fight your Hawkick. I've got a plus 20, mate, so it's not in your interest or mine just to fight. P5. Okay. I don't, I don't want to take you out, basically, is what I'm, what I'm saying. Because I've got a plus 20, it's your race, really. Slow him down. You're locking okay, right let's rear. work together, Jim. Okay, let me pass to give me about a 20 second lead, and uh, that'll be perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, sorry, I missed your message there, mate. Yeah, Loz and Jim have both got penalties. They're, oh, no, please. Oh, I've got... That's going to be it. I'm so close to getting a fucking drive-through. Um, that should have been a good warning. So... I think it's more generous in race. When Loz and Jim oh, were coming to... Daily behind us now. <laughs> that last lap was at 56.3. When Loz and Jim were coming out of the pit lane, they had a message saying pit lane exit closed. Um, and I mean, what were they supposed to do? They came out of the pits, slotted in sort of behind, uh, just in front and behind me. You're locking your right rear. And they got a penalty. Hmm, have you got a pit for fuel, Hawkick? I think you might have. Oh, I think you might have. He's very good with the fuel, is, is Hawkick. How's my fuel? Stand by. That should be about eight minutes of fuel remaining. Two point four liters per lap. We'll need I to think I might have, and I picked a lap after you. <laughs> so unless you have uh, been sipping the fuel, uh, I think you might have to bit. No, don't need to bit. That lap time was fifty-five point six. You're two tenths off the pace in sector one. If everything goes to plan. I mean, <laughs> we saw it a couple. Or was it Hockenheim? where Hawkick and Rocco, they were the two quickest guys on track for the first stint. You're locking your right rear. And they went out, they sat out for a lap longer than everyone else. And I was... Do I you was need on, to pit? I was on vapour. I don't know, I'm just going to have to see how it pans out, to be honest. It's going to be very close. You're suddenly saving or something. <laughs> Get past Bubica on the podium. In fact, I'm on the podium already, aren't I? Yeah. I'm on the podium already because of their penalties. We're seeing lots of right rear locking. That's really unfair, man. 
open. Okay, Marty. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. Stay focused. We're still in this. Oh, corner cut, Loz. That must have been a cut, surely. I know you can take a lot out of that last corner, but... careful enough. Ah, oh, Bibica's got a drive through. So I've just got to be careful now. I'll be second. I'll be second if I can just not get a penalty. Nice gap behind. I hope I didn't force him to do that with my late braking. Hey Andy. Um, sorry, let me... So, I've just got to be super careful now. There's no way I'm catching Hall kick. Okay, Marty, we estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. Well, within 20 seconds. Uh, yes, very true. It was, it was congested, but surely there's like a safety car line perpendicular on the track, and as long as you don't overtake it. See that line that I've just gone, or maybe that line there. As long as you don't overtake after you've gone past that line, isn't that how it generally works in motorsport? I'm presuming that they got a message on screen saying pit lane exit closed, which is stupid, but um, maybe there's no crew chief audio for that. I shouldn't be saving fuel, shouldn't I? How's my fuel? Stand by. I should be alright. I've got like we four think about laps. Four yeah. minutes of fuel remaining. 2.5 litres per lap. We should have just enough fuel to the end. Your last lap time was at 56.4. Sectors 2 and 3 are 0.3 off the pace. Sector 1 is 0.6 off the pace. I don't want to dally too much or else Dilly behind me is going to catch me. Hey Baz. We're seeing lots of right rear locking. I wonder if Hawkick's got any track cuts. Pit exit close to prevent getting ahead of the safety car. Well no, they, they came out. Um, they came out behind it. They were like, I'm making this up slightly, but they came out and slotted in like P3 and P5 or something like that, you know? I didn't see anything wrong with it. Yeah, I get your That's point. That's two minutes left. Two minutes. And there's no way you can, I don't know, yeah. Am I going a bit too slow? Don't want to lose too much time on them. Seven seconds off, okay, that's fine. Two more laps, maybe? Trying to be as safe as possible, no cuts. Good luck in your right rear. Don't know if this is the last lap. We've just got enough fuel. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You've just done a 56.6. Sorry, Hawkick. No worries. Yeah, My was exit was uh, compromised by the back marker. Broke too late. Two minutes of fuel. Plus, I was trying to save your fuel, right mate, rate. by giving you a bit of a helping hand. <laughs> yeah, I think I've managed this just right. Hopefully, this is the last lap. Well, this next lap, unlike what happened on Tuesday.
That's oh. it. Could you do another lap or not, full kick? Yeah, I can do. I have, I have 5.4 left. P4, that's the finish. Oh, well, well done, sir. Well, well done. I've got I thought it, I thought it left. Yeah, I got 6.4, but I thought it was going to be one more lap than that, you see. It was very, very close. Are you and sure that was maybe... the last lap? Was that the last lap, lads? Yeah, 42. <laughs> yeah, it was, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Yeah, it's. Uh, it, 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 I was one second short of an extra lap. Has anybody seen whether oh. the pit exit has any like traffic lights on to indicate whether you can leave or not? That's the only thing I can think of that might. Uh, the well, might my be there. Told me that the exit was closed, and Creep, it cleared up before I exited the pits. Oh, you okay? Okay, I didn't see that. Right. I didn't see that it said exit closed. Yeah. Maybe I just wasn't paying attention, and I just wanted to get out the pit. But hadn't the, safety car, I hadn't the safety car already gone beyond the safety car line, meaning you're not going to get past him, so it should no, have been totally the, fine. The, the, the yeah, we still got behind uh, it, yeah. Yeah, we still came up behind it, but it was just slightly too early. If it did say... The start finish straight. Yes, it was, yes. Watch your speed. Close. But I didn't... Um, I don't yeah. recall seeing a message, but I wasn't looking for one, and it's a message I've never seen before, or even knew that it could do, if you see what I mean. So it was, uh, mm. it might well be more of a learning uh, exercise than anything else to watch for the uh, pet exit close. But I should go watch my replay to see if it does actually have a pet exit close. Okay. Which is the racing lovely battling hawk kick, uh, Tinez. You were in on the mix of servos points. Super Babuka. Um, lots of fun. Thank you, guys. Lost you were there at the end, putting the pressure on. Sorry about yeah, the contact, I wasn't going to uh... give up. Bubica after the first stint. Sorry about that, mate. It's okay. It's okay, mate. Don't worry. Also important to note if you are if you are Cheers, back mark and you are nice one, in front behind the safety car, you have to keep going until it's green because we can't overtake you. No worries. No worries. It's all right. It, it can be confusing. Always learning in this game. There's so much to take in. I think the fact that Crew Chief doesn't have audio bits for like all the different instructions now like had crew chief have said pit layers exit closed you might have thought twice about it you know i don't think it said that did it no i think it only says when it's open yeah but unlucky with the penalties lads that was good fun i think if roy saw a message saying pet exit closed then it probably was the case that it was there but we just didn't cheers chris thanks Steve didn't there. identify it i'm gonna go watch my stream now and see are you watching him play, uh, boy? Yeah, yeah, I will. Cool. I'm not sure, maybe if you turn off certain hot elements, that it won't pop up. Well, I have the one that tells me that, you know, what the speed, speed limit is and that my pit limit is on and all that sort of stuff, so I would assume yeah, it would be in there, if anything. Was, yeah, it showed it underneath that for me. Ah, okay, maybe we didn't get one. In, uh, in nice red, uh, red letters. <laughs> I didn't know that the game also grows the exit. I mean, I think it's realistic. I think that's what it does in real life. If safety cars are going down the pit, yeah. hey, oh, oh, you're going to clash with the safety car. You kind of have to come out behind it or whatever. But uh, yeah. it's good, it's good you're just saying uh, when it's getting open, so it's you know it's closed. Yeah, I'd be interested. Oh, sorry, I'd be interested, Roy, if. Um, uh, you could go into your HUD editor thing and identify which of your which element it's likely to be, if you see what I mean. Yeah, yeah, I'll have a little look. Thank you, mate. All right, um, cheers for the race, everyone. What? Yep, yeah. cheers, uh, yeah, lots yeah, for the cheers. battles. What? Good battles. Yeah, yeah it's good, good one. Yeah, yeah, thanks, that's a nice one. But, but, but aren't you using a crew chief? Because he says when the when the pit is open. No, I don't use crew chief. Yeah, he, so, he, he says when it's open, but he doesn't say that the pit exit is closed. Yeah, precisely. Yeah, after the oh, first so lap he behind. Said it was open, but the exit was closed. Yeah, we got yeah, penalty because we we got penalty because we left the right. pits when we shouldn't have done. I don't think we entered the pits. I don't think it's pits. updated. Yeah, I'm not first. If I'm yeah, but, but, understanding but, you. But, but maybe, because uh, when it's focus yellow, then it, it takes some time before he says pit is open, so... Yeah, after the first lap behind the safety car, after that first lap, he then said pit lane is open, safety car is out. But I think you, you could have still pitted the lap before anyway. Um, and then, as Roy said, he didn't say pit exit is closed. 
So yeah, it's a shame. Maybe there was an, an on-screen message. Who knows? Yeah, I'm just right, watching the stream now. I'll know in a moment. I'll know in a moment. So Flying Hawkick retains the lead on the championship at 122 points. I'm in second with 113. But unfortunately, Jay turns lost a few points there, and he's got 104. P Dilly fourth, Roy fifth, Rubica sixth, Web seventh, Loz eighth, Karazida ninth, Raptor tenth. That's two P2s I've thrown away due to mistakes <laughs> last week and this week. That's two wins back to back for Mr. Hawkick, three podiums in a row. Yeah, well done, Hawkick. Nice one, Ben. Thank All you. Right, guys, thanks for joining. Yep, see you next time. Later, lads. Um, Jim, I think it's uh, the yes, driving sir. info. The driving info section in the heart it showed underneath underneath okay. that i think that's the one right sweet yeah thanks for the support lads that was a that was a fun one um obviously got handed a couple um, i got handed three positions there i think i really should have been in fifth if they hadn't have got there was um Lars and Jay turn with those silly penalties and then Bubica managed to get that drive through which I was very very close to getting as well I thought I had got a drive through so I got very lucky there so somehow second in the championship nice uh, so tomorrow we've got the final rounds of the uh, Megan trophy uh, we're racing at Fontana sports car course raced here a few times now had a little practice with Chris last last Friday around here um, yeah, I am sort of looking forward to this league being done. Even though I did, I did get a single win so far when it rained. Um, I just don't, I don't feel at one with this car. It's just tricky. I think, yeah, maybe just blame the setup. But um, yeah, it's not quite as planted as as I thought it would be. Yeah. So um, last round. So who's? I think Noodle's leading, isn't he? Yeah, Noodle, Loz, Wien Diesel, and then me. So really to secure it, Noodle still got to get a win. I think. Yeah, he can probably get away with second or third maybe, but um, yeah, he's got a bit of a gap there. So Auto Club Speedway tomorrow, um, and then I'm not totally sure if I'll make this race, but we're doing a final test in the GT1s at Imola Historic 72, um, and then there's the Formula High Tech at Spa 93. Um, I'm more likely to make that one, but I'm not sure if I'm going to make either of those races. Um, and of course, there's Mets also doing their Rocco Championship round three. Um, I'm not sure if they've. Yeah, I think they've been running through just race, not without just race. Maybe I'm not sure. Yeah. Um, and then we've got some off-season madness coming up. Um, some micro machines at Adelaide, uh, and then Roy has lined up. And then we've got the uh, V8s. Oh, he hasn't listed them yet, but Roy. Is, is selected um, Formula Juniors on some dirt circuits, which will be fucking nuts. Hey, Debs. It went all right, mate. We came second. Uh, Flying Hawk it won. Two, that's two wins in a row for him, three podiums in a row. But I was gifted a few positions because Loz and Jim both got pit exit penalties under the safety car. So they both got 20 seconds. And Bubica, who was just in front of me, he got a drive through. So I was running in fifth, but we finished second. So not too bad. Yeah, it was good. It was really good fun. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, so Roy, <laughs> I've got to go give them a go, I think. I might I might give it a quick go now, but I'm about to go and join um, Roy's stream. So if you check my channel, there's a link to Roy underscore 33 ML. Um, it's on Twitch as well, but I'll be joining him in his chat because he'll be watching the replay now. So it'd be cool for you to come along and join. If you don't follow him, do so because he's, he's a great lad. Um, good content, quality guy. Uh, streams a lot as well so go show him some love but yeah formula juniors at dirt tracks so the only championship i've ever won in ams2 was the formula junior with the ams2 guys that was a really fun one um but driving it around a dirt track we'll see how that goes so that's going to come up in maybe a couple weeks so that'll be uh one to look out for so yeah appreciate the support thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace